here is an interesting but a slightly tricky question right which of the following sorting algorithms has a running time that is least dependent on the initial order of the inputs right we know that quick sort right the time complexity of quick sort could be order of n log n or order of n square right based on the ordering of the inputs right so quick sort certainly the running time of quick sort is certainly dependent on the initial order so this can't be the answer what about insertion sort insertion sort also the best case of insertion sort is order of n and the worst case is order of n square right so insertion sort also depends the 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 time complexity of insertion sort also depends on the input what about merge sort whatever happens merge sort still has to do the n log n whether it's a best case worst case average case in every case its time complexity is order of n log n so merge sort is a potential answer but here is the trick what about selection sort selection sort also the time complexity is order of n square but there is a subtle detail here which is for selection sort you have order of n square comparisons and order of n swaps right now if you look at it if your array is already sorted if your array is already sorted if your array is already sorted right then you won't need these swaps which means the eventual running time even though the complexity the overall complexity is still order of n square the eventual running time of the algorithm itself okay because we have discussed that swaps or writes take more time than reads right so the eventual running time of selection sort would depend on whether the array is already sorted or not while the time complexity doesn't change right the actual running time itself the physical clock time itself would differ slightly because if your array is already sorted you don't require these swaps to be take to, to be taking place right so it's a slightly tricky question and i was also confused when i read this because selection sort also has for all cases order of n square but if you think slightly deeply in terms of comparisons and swaps you'll realize that mud sort is the most see the question here is it is least dependent the question is not that it's not dependent at, at all right the question here is which of these has is least dependent and it's talking about running time itself not the complexity so amongst these four the least dependent would still be mud sort because selection sort time complexity would depend on swaps and number of swaps would depend on whether the array is already sorted or not